Hello ladies and gentlemen, hope you're having a great day and welcome to the Tundra Dude 34 YouTube channel. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you're new to the channel, welcome aboard. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you know every time I put up a new video and or a live stream. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is a very unplanned video. As most of you know that have been around here a long time, I live my life on websites like Auto Trader, Car Gurus. I'm always looking at Tundras, whether it be old or new. I'm looking at them for myself, but I'm also looking at them to find something cool and crazy out there for you. Now today, I spotted a Lunar Rock 2022 Limited Double Cab with the TRD Off-Road Package. Now there was one, or at least looks like, one modification done to this Tundra. It is for sale. So even if you own a 2022 Tundra, you may want to check this out because this modification will make your Tundra look amazing and it's not that expensive. So first, let's take a peek at the truck here. Once again, 2022 Lunar Rock. They're asking 58888 for this truck right now. Uh, I will put the link in the description below for the truck. It's in Indiana, Andy Moore Toyota, I believe it's called. This truck has just under 6,000 miles, lunar rock exterior. It has the soft text black leather on the inside. This is the regular iForce engine, 10-speed automatic transmission with four-wheel drive. Please remember, when you get these double cabs, especially in the limited configuration now, they're loaded up real nice. This one has the extra stuff on it, like the moonroof you will see, uh, the JBL sound system, very nicely loaded. It has the premium headlights up front. So let's take a look. You can tell me what you think. Nice side shot here. And that's the modification I wanna talk about right up front. It is the TRD Pro grill. It's not like it used to be. You don't have to buy the surround with it, which makes it very expensive. Now you can buy the insert right in the middle. Now, you could go body color. The previous owner could have went body color here on that grill surround as well. That is an option. That is on sparksparts.com as well. Uh, but even with the chrome lip around that TRD Pro grill, it just changed the look dramatically, especially if you don't get the TRD off-road model. The TRD off-roads come with a unique grill that is very nice, but the next step up is this TRD Pro insert here. But as you can see, nice side shot. You get the 20-inch TRD wheels with the Falcon Wild Peak all-terrain tires. Really good look going down the body. Body color uh, mirror caps. You get the chrome handles. Uh, some people like the double cab, some people don't. It's gonna come down to that for you, of course, if you're a fan of it. I wanna give you a little side shot here and tell me what you think. Obviously, six and a half foot bed. The double cab back seats have gotten a little bit smaller. If you have passengers that are gonna be back there all the time, especially if they're a bit taller, I strongly suggest you either go look at a double cab in person or just go right for the crew max because uh, you're going to want your passengers to be comfortable back there. The old double cabs, you could totally fit people back there, no problem. But these ones look like they got a little bit smaller as far as the back seat. Uh, so just keep that in mind before making purchase. You definitely want to go in person uh, and see this truck before you spend all of this money because as we know, these are not cheap trucks nowadays. So here is a shot of that TRD Pro grill up front. As you can see, there's that little area for the LED light bar, but the way Toyota set it up that even if you don't get that light bar in there, it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look like it's missing anything. If you want to add it, you can. Down low is the Toyota Safety Sense sensor, and this has the little camera uh, for the 360 view and all the bird's eye camera options they have going on here. You will see that right under the Toyota Heritage logo, but a nice looking grill up front. I feel like it ties in uh, that black section in the middle that a lot of people just do not like. You can comment below and tell me what you think. Right between the fog lights, it says Tundra. That area down, everybody wishes that was body color. I'd love to hear what you think, but the Toyota Heritage Grill, the, I should say the TRD Pro Grill, uh, really does tie that front end together. Another side shot, Lunar Rock is beautiful. It is gone for 2023 on the TRD Pro trim. It is still available on other trims, but it is not available for TRD Pro anymore. It has been replaced by magnetic gray metallic. Uh, so if you can find a TRD Pro in Lunar Rock for 2022, you might wanna grab onto that. This has the chrome rear bumper uh, ends on it. You can change that out to body color once again if you don't like it. It has a four x four logo in the back with the big Tundra. It looks like uh, they put the black inlay in that Tundra logo across the bed. And once again, this is four wheel drive. Even though it's TRD, they do make TRDs that are two wheel drive, so make sure you're always checking on that as well. When it comes to interior, this thing has basically all the options you could get when it comes to a limited double cab, which is more than it's ever been. So now you could get the JBL sound system in the limited double cab. You can get the moonroof, which has never been available on a Tundra in a double cab configuration. It always had to be Crew Max. Now you can get it on the limited double cab only. SR5 does not get 
uh, moon roofs at all. So double cab or crew max, no moon roofs. But if you want it, if you went to the limited and you got the crew max, you get the panoramic roof. Uh, but if you go double cab, this is optional. It's not on every one. So if you want that moon roof on the double cab, you got to make sure you check to make sure it has it. Uh, soft text, black leather seats, uh, you know, heated, cooled. Like I said, the options are uh, plenty on the new generation Tundra for sure. And there's a great shot of those Wild Peak tires uh, that everybody loves. They have always been the dark horse of the all-terrain tire picks for Tundra owners. Uh, everybody loves these tires, and now they're standard on a lot of the models, including the TRD Pro, which is awesome. And I feel like these black 20-inch TRD wheels are the best-looking ones available for the new generation Tundra among all the different variations they have out there, including the TRD Pro. I like these ones better. Uh, but that's just me. Please keep in mind, if you get the TRD off-road package in SR5, it is an 18-inch wheel and tire package, and it is different from this wheel. This is the wheel you get on the 1794 and Limited when you go TRD off-road. Just something to keep in mind if you're shopping there. And once again, the price is $58,888. Uh, so I don't know if you're going to pay that or not. This one, 6,000 miles, like we said. Uh, you know, nothing is cheap out there right now. But this is a nice looking truck. And with that grill up front, I definitely wanted to help some of the owners out there if they're looking for uh, just something to tie it all together. And there's a lot of ways you could do it. So as you can see, that grill is $195. If you use, this is sparksparts.com. If you use promo code TUNDRADUDE34, it saves you 5%. On this website, they also have things like, we talked about this in the video, the rear bumper's chrome. You could change that out to body color. The handles are chrome. You could change that out to body color. Uh, the surround around the TRD Pro Grill on the front of that truck we just looked at, you could change that out to body color. You could take all the chrome off the truck, but the way that that owner had it, it actually looked pretty good. So if you're not looking to spend, you know, a thousand dollars on all this de-chroming, this is a nice start to tie it all together real nice. Once again, the TRD Off-Road Grill is unique this year and it is beautiful, but there's nothing like that big Toyota heritage splashed across the front. Uh, with this insert right here. So once again, $195 if you already own, own a Toyota. Is this something you feel like is needed on the truck? Because that grill insert will even fit on SR5 and you know everything like that. It's just a nice little touch. And I love the fact that Toyota made it so it's just an insert this time. If you look behind me, that's a 2016 Quicksand TRD Pro setup on the front. Now, if you were to buy that, you have to buy the grill here, the insert, and all the way around it has to be bought too. All right, that little spot on top, that's optional, but this down here has to come with the grill. It wasn't just an insert situation uh, for the last generation. So this makes it a lot easier and a lot cheaper. And saving money right now is rare, but we'll take any penny saved that we can. So once again, Sparks Parts, Tundra Dude 34 promo code, it saves you 5% site-wide. So what'd you think about the truck? What'd you think about the truck's price? And what do you think about that TRD Pro grill? Do you feel like that is a must-have option on a Tundra. For the old school classic fans of Toyota, for the people that used to own the old Toyota pickups with that Toyota splashed across the front like that, I feel like that's a big deal and I think it just looks fantastic and I love that it's available uh, for all the trims out there. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Until next time, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, Facebook at TundraDude34, TundraDude34 gmail.com. You guys have a great day. Be safe and be well.